Hey everyone, welcome back to another session by K21 Academy. In this video, we will be talking about what is OpenShift Enterprise Administrator DO280. So let's get started with our agenda for our day. We will be talking about what is OpenShift, why is OpenShift being used these days so aggressively, we'll be discussing about some outlines of OpenShift Administration who can take up the certification and some of the easiest ways in which we can help you out. All right, so let's start with what is OpenShift Administrator. Well, OpenShift is a containerized application platform that allows enterprises to manage container deployments and scale their applications using Kubernetes. There are two perspectives on the web console. First is developer and the other one is administrator. As an administrator, you can manage the clusters, the users, the projects, and much more. In other words, it is a layered system wherein each layer is tightly bounded with the other layer using Kubernetes and Docker cluster. The architecture of OpenShift is designed in such a way that it can support and manage Docker containers, which are hosted on top of all the layers using Kubernetes. And in this, you would be learning about, you know, how you can install, configure, manage Red Hat, OpenShift Enterprises, and OS instances. And if I talk about OpenShift Enterprise by Red Hat, it is a platform as a service product that provides predefined deployment environments for applications of all the types through its users container technology. This enables an environment that supports DevOps principles, such as reduced time to market and continuous delivery. You will learn how to install and configure an instance of OpenShift Enterprise by Red Hat. And if I talk about the prerequisites for the same, then you would be not surprised to know that DO180 is strongly suggested before you dive on to DO280. All right, now if I just talk about the benefits of using OpenShift. Well, the environment is very consistent. It is automated, built and deploy. The delivery pipeline is very concise. It is highly secure. Also, it is a unified operations model. And the most important part, that is, it is on-demand infrastructure. So all in all, it is very easy. You'll be able to use it very easily to migrate things and on the cloud and it's you're going to love it. OK, now moving next, like who should take up this certification or what is the audience for this DO280? So if I just, you know, talk about under the umbrella kind of thing, then the system administrators are responsible for creating the OS instances and also for deploying applications also for creating process customizations, as well as managing the instances and the projects. So here, if I just cut it down to three simple terms, then people who are developers, system administrators, system architects, and anybody who wants their career in cloud, they can definitely opt for this certification. And now we'll be discussing about some of the outlines for DO280. So here you'll be able to describe the architecture of Red Hat OpenShift Container Platform. You'll be able to describe the OpenShift installation. You'll be able to configure the authentication for HTTP password. You'll be able to configure application security. And you'll be able to configure the OpenShift networking for applications. So it's a bundle of new knowledge for you. And if all these words are sounding like so new to you, then we have something really, really, really special for you. That is, you can book your free seat for a free class on OpenShift for beginners. And in this, we will be covering about what is OpenShift Red Hat, why OpenShift is needed. You will be talking about a different architecture and its components, who should learn, how you can learn, everything. We'll be covering everything in, a, in our four week roadmap. So, all you have to do is just log on to k21academy.com forward slash openshift02. And let me just show you a small demo like how you can do it. So all you have to do is just log on to k21academy.com forward slash openshift02. After that, you just have to click on book your free seat now or register now. 
After that, you just have to enter your details whenever you're available, your name, your email address, your phone number, and you can just proceed ahead. You'll be seeing a URL. You can save it to your calendars. And I will see you in the next class. Till then, take care and keep hustling.